Hey up everybody, Magpie Gaming here, I hope you're all doing well. Another Escape from Tarkov video. Now, if you follow any of their social media accounts, you will have been bombarded over the last few days with images of guns. Some of these are real world pictures and some of them are in-game stills. I'm assuming that these are all weapons that are going to be coming to the game at some point. Obviously, the in-game stills, those are definitely coming to the game because they're already in it. But it looks like they've been at some kind of convention. The, you could see that some of the pictures were of a, a gun range. Now, I've got two issues with these pictures so the first issue I have is that a lot of these pictures seem to show different variants variants of the AK which is fine it's good to have variety in the game but don't we already have enough AKs in the game we have a lot of AKs already there were a lot of AKs to begin with more AKs were added to the game and it seems like we're going to get more AKs added I mean just how many fucking AKs are there I personally don't want to see any more AKs in the game I think there is an AK already in the game for every kind of situation I don't see the point of adding more but like I say, variety is good, so if you do like the AKs, then it looks like you're going to get more to play with, which is good for you. But for me personally, I don't give a fuck about the AKs no more. It's very rare that I use them. I will use, if I do use them, I use either the 74U, because it's needed for some of the tasks, the 74N, the AKM, again needed for some tasks, and the 105 now and again because I quite like the way it looks when it's modded but I won't it's not my go-to gun it's one that I will use rarely so I don't really want to see more AKs come into the game and I don't really see why we need more AKs in the game but it looks like we are getting some now it makes me wonder if Battlestate are actually struggling to get hold of weapons from other countries now obviously being based in Russia I don't suppose it's as easy as phoning up a gun maker and saying can you send send me one of these blah 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 I'd like to 3d model it for my game I would assume that there's maybe issues with customs with getting weapons from other countries sent I don't know if it's as easy as being able to simply post a weapon from one country to another I don't know really how all of that works so I'm wondering if obviously they'll have access to the AKs being in Russia so I'm wondering if it's just simply a logistical problem that they can't get hold of other weapons to 3d model I really don't know I mean that's just me you know that's a wild fear but it could hold water I don't know but yeah I don't really want to see more AKs in the game although it looks like we are getting some now my second issue with these pictures is that there is no fucking description as to what we're looking at they simply put a couple of hashtags or one hashtag escape from Tarkov and that is it we have no idea what we're looking at I had a fucking gun expert you know I just want to play a game and use real world weapons but it would be nice if they could put oh this is the blah blah gun this will be coming to the game game at some point we've been testing it it does this it does this it's this caliber it's this range but there's nothing across facebook instagram and twitter they're putting the same pictures with the same hashtags and no description as to what we're looking at how hard is it to put a description when you're posting a fucking picture it can't be that hard now i did pose the question i responded to one of the pictures and asked if it you know it would be nice if we could have a description i've had a couple of people reply to me with fucking no shit sherlock comments of it's a gun what more do you need to know well i need to know quite a lot to be honest you know, if I want to commentate on this game, I need to know what I'm looking at, and I fucking don't, because they don't give you no description. So, <laughs> I don't want to rant about this game, but sometimes it is fucking frustrating following it. It's so frustrating that it's almost like they're trolling their audience, you know, ooh, look what we've been testing. Will it be coming to the game? Won't it be coming to the game? It's like fucking Russian roulette. Will we be getting it? Won't we be getting it? You just don't know. So, it wouldn't be so hard for them just to put this is this gun, it does this, it does this, we're looking to bring it to the game, maybe, maybe not, it's not hard, it really isn't, it's not fucking rocket science, but it just seems like it's really hard for them to do the most basic of things sometimes, so yeah, you know, I don't mean to rant at Escape from Tarkov, I do love the game as I've said before, but... <clears throat> fuck's sake sort your shit out anyway that's me done for today that is my rant sorry that it's been a rant but i just i don't know they frustrate me to fuck sometimes but there you go anyway any comments leave them in the comments section down below uh that's pretty much it really as always ladies and gentlemen thank you very much for watching and listening i don't know why i say ladies because according to the youtube analytics no ladies actually watch my channel but i do like to be inclusive of you know the genders so there we go so yes as always ladies and gentlemen thank you very much for watching and listening don't forget to like share and subscribe and i'll catch you in the next one take care